Yeah. I just want to have a little conversation. I'm watching this reading, right? <clears throat> and I'm thinking about all of the people, the satanic energy. Just Satan, not Lucifer, not the devil, Satan. The Elodio energy. The one that look a lot like this Ken, Kenja Jackson or whatever they just put in office. Right? Now I know Elodio spoke about having problems with fertility, infertility, right? So I know she want to be me. She want to be, there's shit that's going on with me in my womb that's questionable. Okay. And I know she want to be in the position that I'm in. She want the family. She want the man. She want to take me down. She want, this is the act against Satan against not Lucifer, not the serpent, not the devil, but Satan. It's seeking to see who they can devour. Consume. The Babylonian energy. Cannibalism, searching DNA bloodlines. This is what they specialize in, ain't it? The land, the resources, the pirate energy, grave digging energy. That, what is it? Who sent those two spies over? Rahab, right? The Lord God, which is not God. It's the one that came and started fiddling with DNA after God was done. So, we have, yeah, so we have this energy, seeking to see who they can devour, knowing bloodlines, family lines, knowing who the top motherfucker, who the goat is, the real goat is. So then these people, Moab and Moshe, and them send them in. This is why they couldn't get into heaven. This is where we're going to stop this shit today. Because it was the wrong one. They touched the tree. Now they probably killed off or cut off mentally or whatever the connection between the two divine ones. Okay, the two gods, right? So they can take their treasures and their, their, their abundance, right? And build. These type of people that once they build, they for the people. But once they build, it's all right. You see what I'm saying? They for the people until they get what the fuck they need from them. And then it's all about them. Searching Akashic records of those ones. The children of God. Imprisoning them mentally, spiritually, attack, sorcery, and all this shit, and all these doctored up documents, the Moorish and Islamic energy. The ones that want to tear about around tear apart the family because they want the children. So the same thing they try to do to us is what's gonna happen, why they can't cross over, why the children actually gonna be coming with the children of God, and they're not gonna have the children. So these are people that will try to use this court system to do things to people's family line. They will use the court system to try to imprison people or put them into mental asylums or in jail. Um, and while they're in there, they will go ahead and make sure. That's why somebody was saying a whole bunch of women are being impregnated right now. They're going to be imprisoned. This can be in your own home, a mental prison to keep you in a certain mindset so you can't move. Two of swords don't know which way to go. All in all, they just want what's in your womb. Because that's what I'm saying. They're using the womb as is more valuable than gold at this moment. <clears throat> so I was looking at this reading and I was seeing what she was saying here. And how she separated these two. At the top, and she and I and I, I was I was saying, oh, go ahead and put it to the side. And it's funny because she put it to the side. This temperance, this is that brewery of the Bruton bloodline here, because she was saying that they were searching searching out bloodlines here. Now I'm already knowing this. I'm already know that this is why I've been attacked. This is why they've been watching me. This is why they've been trying to do these particular things to me. Why I've been feeling like my womb is under under attack. Why I've been feeling like whatever it was with this, this Ace of Wands energy was cut off the Bagram or Bruton Graham energy. Mm. This is the Empress. This is the real Empress here. All right. But again, we have the Knot of Isis. We bring in law and we get not, not law. We bring in order to the court. All right. 
So again, that's what, that's what is not of ISIS is behind China. <clears throat> this is why I feel like that energy is shifty when it comes to Trump. Because, yeah, we stand for the same thing, America first. But sometimes Satan, I told y'all those three days, the 20th to the 23rd or 24th or whatever. That it, it says uh, Satan something on that card. And it's still sticking out that jar in my kitchen. In the can that I had stuck the cards in. So, this is like somebody trying to get a deal, right? But, you know, that's the thing about that satanic energy. It comes in as if it is caring and loving and all this stuff. But it's really not. So, I can tell the energy shift on the, the soulmate. He's back involved in something now. And again, he was out of work for a while. They, it was something to do with his blood pressure or something like that. But it was legit. But they still told him no. He couldn't get his card to go back. That was strange to me. But I felt like that was a grip that these Godfrey forces put on him, right? To get him to come back to that other energy. To this other woman or man, whatever, okay? This other person, all right? Um, so that was the grip. So it brought me back to Biden saying, yeah, it's nothing worse than a man having to come upstairs and walk upstairs and tell his wife that he don't have his job. That's exactly what this masculine did. When he found out that he was upset, he was going up and down the stairs and shit, talking about he, he ain't going to be able to work and all this other shit, right? Okay. I told you, and this is when I knew my conversations or whatever, this was a, about last year sometime. When I would do a video, the, the media would rebuttal that, right? But they don't stand in your face and reproach you in your face. They do it sideways. They use coded terms and shit like that well then don't don't come for my don't come for my information and don't come from my channel this is my personal stuff that i talk about or public um uh messages that as a messenger that i give to the public it's not all about me so you cannot use those in a fucking trial or whatever the fuck they trying to do all right first of all <clears throat> So I'm noticing all of a sudden now this person, you know, a couple weeks ago, the person didn't even want to have nothing to do with the D baby. This person has never been a baby person. But now all of a sudden putting on a show all like, oh, the baby, the baby. Like, what the fuck is going on here? Okay. See, because this, this is the energy of someone who was influenced by spirits for a long time, but they had to take a break. And I feel like at that time, that's when they tried to make it seem like I'm unfit and this person is not because now they're stopping drinking. You see what I'm saying? It's, it's something going, it's, this, this is definitely that, and the reason why I can't even come together with this person on that level no more, intimacy, because I can sense this bitch's energy on him. The work or the spell work or sorcery or whatever the fuck they're using, right? So I can only really look to the twin flame and twin ray, but it seemed like this is a joint energy. There's something about a woman and a baby in a masculine energy that was under attack or cut off, sent away to a distance, cut off mentally from this connection or killed, period. But that masculine is that other part of me from a long ago that would be only my fucking husband, right? And whatever else came after that would not even be legit. But see, these, this is why they kept it under the wraps and watched me all this time to see what I would pick up on with my gifts. But then when the, the, you see what I'm saying? All this time they want to try to use my gifts to tie me down to a mental illness, but that's not the fucking case. That means all of these tarot readers must also go to jail or go into a mental asylum. Do you see what I'm saying? <laughs> But no, it's me, because this is the goat. This is the empress. The one that is going to rule regardless. The masculine, feminine, damn near emperor slash empress. One of a kind. They didn't make no more. <laughs> All they could do was cut me off from heaven. That's why I can't remember and see certain things that these people can kind of see. Because they've cut off something. And they want to finish it off by cutting the whole shit off. Or at least go ahead and diagnosing me with something um, to write me off. Okay? Again, allegedly, this is just story time. So I'm looking about this union here, though. It's almost like a fair trade, though. Because she was saying that this knight, and I can't remember who else is down here, they didn't really want to be with somebody. They just wanted a baby from, they wanted this bloodline or this DNA. All right, so this is the other masculine. This is probably the scorpionic energy, possibly. Right? And then I feel like the energy, the message from here is coming from the Gemini that that is 
kind of sad, kind of maybe see something differently now and sad about the way that they handle things. <clears throat> right? Mm hmm. Yeah. Because they would want the Empress back in this energy here. Bound. Gagged. With the, with the border open here so that people can have access to it. So it can, you know, and this is where Fauci energy and that whole shit with AIDS and stuff come into play. Right? Hmm. So I was looking at an image today. I said, why is that eight back there? Because you know they said it came from monkeys or something. But it was on a tarot card. Hmm. Something about this emperor. Because again, with this emperor, this is how they wanted me to be. One of these emperors want me to be in that situation right here. Right? But this is my cup over here. They want to give this cup to somebody else. Your 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 melanin, your um sight, your insight, your anointing, your your birthright. This is by God. This is directly by God. The, the, the Queen of Cups is more so AI energy. People going into places and finding out the language, the love language, the language, studying to feel, to see how to be a woman because maybe some of these people are not. Right? And this, this emperor, for some reason, doesn't want this empress. It's not because he doesn't like her. He want to keep this empress here so he can also have access to her southern border. Okay? When he wants. But she can't strive or do anything or be with anybody else or be happy or, you know, be successful or any of that. Any of that. This is what this emperor here wants. He wants full, total control. See, it's almost like in that episode where he said, if I can't control the animal, why do I want to keep it? So instead of, they, they want to get the child and then slaughter. Again, this is what I'm picking up. It's just what it is. It's Claire fucking everything. We, we in the Claire port now, all right? So again, there's some sense of judgment coming here. We had this card. We pulled this card earlier. <clears throat> but look how this mask, the two of wands. Look how that wand that I told y'all was sitting on top of that brick, that, that um, block, to make it look like it's the better one, the one that was exalted to make it seem like it's more at a greater height, Okay. Is not the one. It's this one right here. Okay, you'll have to go back and look at the reading right before, the, not the reading, but the story that could be seen as fictional, okay, um, prior to this one. So, this one represents the real deal. This is the goat back here that they hiding behind this person while they exalting this one up into a position of power. A forever position, which they should be dragged the fuck out of. Because this is somebody that said... Possibly if this is it. See, because we're looking at a dual nature and an allegorical mm, something here. All right? Parallel energy. So this is in the physical, but spiritually, mm -hmm, I'm just saying. Because this is a forever position. So. This may be want somebody wanting to take, have this person's forever situation because they can't be pulled out from here. Right? They can't be pulled out from this position. I think these are forever positions, if I'm not mistaken. I don't know why that even makes any sense. That's some shit that should be changed, okay? Because um, I don't feel like we've looked at this person thorough enough. I don't think they've been vetted thoroughly enough, okay? This is why shit been fucked up for so long, probably, right? Okay, so you got this wand back here. That's actually the one. The one that's going to be left standing with this masculine energy here. Hmm. So we have the two of cups. This is some exchange, exchanging of DNA, some kind of coming together, intertwining, interlocking energy here. Okay, but then we got the death to this because it's death to whatever them raising up this other stick that's not even the one. This is the one. This is the stick that wants to be this stick, but because it's this position, it's education, and it's background uh, due to the how society would look at it, right? Even though they're stealing gifts from the real one. The son of man stealing gifts from the sons of God. They got to get it from somewhere to put it in with AI. Which probably AI just means that it's artificial because it's not they're not authentic. <laughs> so this is idol worship. So that's why we cutting that shit down right there. That's why it's not here anymore. So I'm going to read this person's reading. Okay. Because again, we talking about King David bloodline. This is what they want. The blood of Christ. They want to be washed with the blood, but they just don't want Christ. 
Yeshua may be safe, but also I feel like something is exalting me into that Yeshua energy. So did they do something to Yeshua? And now that's going to play. That's why I'm, I'm resonating really heavy with his energy today, because it's the dual thing. The Jesus and the Christ is the two that makes that and the, the combining or coming together of those two is what makes God on earth. OK, so we have this man sitting here sad with no cups. We got the five of the pentacles here with nobody being left out in the cold. So this makes it seem, seem like this is some kind of deal or something, right? But you notice the top of this person's head is here. And I, when I seen that, I said, you know what? Somebody about to lose their fucking mind for trying to do what they did to the empress and, and to this ace of wands energy possibly. Which I see, that's straight, that's a wand coming, a clean wand coming straight from fucking God. Straight from the higher up. This is something ordained by. This made me think about ancestry here. American God. Old world God. Old God energy. The OG. Right? Yeah. And also I feel like this has to do with the death of whatever the situation is. Yeah, because this king. I'm telling you. This king is laying at the foot of this, this horse. This white horse. With this death card. This Pope or this person, this Vatican member or whatever is standing here. And then this child and his mother is sitting here. This could also be a hierophant. And you got this child and his mother here. Okay. I feel like this situation with this red, this person right here with the two of wands is representing the energy with a lodial. This death is going to cause death to, because the, these, these are two of my biggest problems. I feel the people that have been attacking the most. Okay. Um, th this is going to cause death to the moon too. This is, this is representing the moon. This is this connection that was supposed to be. And these two people are getting in the way of it. And that's why it's going to be healed. Death to that shit. And then we're going to go ahead and remove that idol that they're trying to place there. Right. Because this is blocking this particular union that the ancestors, that DNA, that's something that you cannot, you cannot change unless, again, you do what I'm telling you that they plan to possibly do. Now, I guess if I get in trouble for this, this person here should get in trouble for it too, all right? Because it's kind of, it's not in her exact, re I'm rereading her reading, okay? A second opinion, okay? Because I feel like somehow this person, this Sag, Sheriff Badge, Right. For some reason, this energy, I, you know, it's, it's very foot floppy to me. I don't I don't know, but I'm just saying. But you see this last man standing here. It's almost like this energy. Next time I stand tall, I want to be standing for you. Hmm. And look at these two dogs. You can you can barely see the man here. OK, but you see these two dogs. They're loyal. It's about loyalty. This this is the loyal energy here they may be connected to that but it's because there's something about the cus the, the culture in the it's something about what's I, don't, I keep hearing siberian and and i keep hearing you know i seen a post earlier about mongoloids so again it may be it may be calling that out i don't know why i'm hearing like i don't know maybe even china russia um canada canaan canine it may be, again, because we did see True North in that one card is the crown. So it may seem like this person is getting a victory down here. But I'm just like, no, nah, they shouldn't even get that because these motherfuckers is foul. So even this makes me think about another soul siblings reading the other day saying about one of the people with this union is going to have to go back and get fair treatment for everybody. Because, because of what these people did. They have to go back and swing the sword again. Okay. So it's making me think about, again, I posted earlier that they're going to see the sun coming in the cloud. So it reminded me of a video I did a while back with a certain person in the video with their head in the clouds, right? Because <clears throat> I'm telling you, it's replica energy going on here. Trump saying that's not the same person, this person not the same. Again, this time that this pharaoh came in, he did not know the children. You see what I'm saying? So I'm making this make me think about some artificial shit here. OK, this is this may not be the same sun. It may not be the same wand. Somebody might have did something to this wand here because I felt the separation. OK, 
They even may have altered this wand and brought them back. But they may not have the same mindset. They may be trained assassins now. You see what I'm saying here? Because it's almost like the energy of Mr. and Mrs. Smith when they both had the same assignment, right? And then they thought, you know, they, they was either going to get back together or whatever. But then they, um, they had that same assignment and then they was going to have to kill, that they, was, they found out that they were having to kill each other, okay? So again, I'd rather just kill the fucking system. And anybody that's trying to play this stupid game here that they're trying to play, anybody involved in this shit, they all guilty. They know what the fuck it is. So this is the, I can't remember what pinnacles this is. Eight, seven, something like that. But this, this person is sitting here looking at the one that he, the one that he, the women that they almost had or the woman that they almost had. That's down here, that pinnacle that's loose sitting in front of his feet. But the reason why they can't do what they want to do with this one is because this is the only one that's sitting up against water and earth. It's that Bilquist energy from American God that they came back to try to save her, Tech Boy, which I think is the X energy possibly. Could even be a part of the Sagittarius or Scorpionic energy, okay? In the shadow, the shadow moon or whatever his name was, right? That I feel like represents one of these masculines here. Or even myself sometimes that, that energy resonates with me, okay? And so this, um, what was I saying? Mm. Oh, but by the time they came back, they tried to put her in a mental place. They tried to break her spirit. She called in the um, Oshun, right? That's what I, I this is what I called in last night. The Orishas, my fault. The Orishas. I'm like, why? Why the Orishas? Is the Orishas here? Okay. So again, this is the Ori the Orisha energy coming in, which gives me Virgo energy here. I'm thinking about two Virgos right now. One above, one below. One that's in a distance that wants to come home. One that is very, her, her features, see, stand out to me as somebody I knew in a past lifetime. Which means probably 20 years ago or something. But the person's still around, but they don't look the same. You see what I'm saying? Now that you start seeing what the fuck I'm saying. <clears throat> so it brought me to the scriptures. I'll tell the North, give, give them up. In the South, don't hold back. Bring back my children from afar. Everyone that I made for my, you see what I'm saying? Bring them back. So this is a story of fucking creation. There's three stories, two, at least two stories of creation in Genesis. Possibly three. Yeah, we got this hangman here. Somebody is in hangman energy. I feel like somebody is close, listening close to whatever this is that's going on. This two of pinnacles. Yeah, because this knight was juggling me in that energy. That th th these energies that I've been mentioning, they were juggling. Right? But this is another type of this is another type of relationship here, okay? I'm just saying, they needed something from me, some type of essence from the empress here. The pineal, the heart, the, they needed a broken heart to harden the heart to get me in my segment energy so that I, it could seem like I'm lashing out, but it's just bringing order. It's just my eye. Let, but, but in the energy, not so love and light. It's R-E-S-P-E-C-T. Is that how it is? Yeah, okay, something like that. Find out what it means, all right? Or if I even spelled it right, okay. So, again, this is the lover's card here. Yeah, because... Look at how it's sitting here. Because they want to erase out this person. And, and I'm going to show you something else about this here. Hold on. Because then I thought about Eve. They want to make it about Adam. They want to take, but, but the whole time Adam been throwing these fiery missiles. Seem like towards Eve. And she like, why? Why are you forsaking me? You know, looking at this energy up here like, why? What the, f what, what? And, and this is the thing, just be a man about it. Whoever this is, this might not even be my personal story, this part here, but be a man about it. This, is, this makes me think about society as a whole or a collective. These higher ups that don't want change, but they want to bring all the change in the world to the American people and to just regular common um, people, everyday people. All right? They can't take the heat. Right? So they want to cut off this energy this could be my energy or somebody else's energy possibly and they want to use they want to cut this woman woman off again uh they want to cut off a part of this peak this peak reminds me of another person here 
It's making me think about that wand energy sent from formed from the earth. Like again, that they took this, they took something here and put it together and created this ace of wand energy that's sent straight from God. All right. <clears throat> so I said a long time ago, I feel like the most high God energy was um, in that Russian video. If if you look at all the leaders at that time, it seems like that's the one that has the most stability or whatever. Okay. Russia. Okay. But Russia, Islamic, Moorish energy is all tied in with that sneaky peak card, the Seven of Swords. Which makes me think about, I don't know why I just heard Pete Buttigieg and Pete Davis, whatever. But, oh, David's son, though. Huh. But then, what, what is it, Solomon or ja David? Okay, that is that energy. Hmm. Yeah, is it Solomon or <laughs> mm -hmm. that represent that Moorish energy? When but when it comes to Esther, because Esther, because that's that primordial energy here. That's that ether, etheric energy. That Esther or Astarte or a star energy. Okay, um, that 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 energy. She had dual husbands or companions, right? So society don't want to see that. See, they're, they're used to masculines or men having a lot of choices or kings having a... But again, if I'm a king too, you see what I'm saying? So if we even talk about the Eve gene or we're talking about these women from the Caribbean that were able, that, that um, uh, they come out um, one sex and then by a certain age, sometimes they change over to a different sex. This might not be your outer appearance, but it may be your makeup. It may be, that may be something that has to do with me. It makes me think about Barbados. And I feel like the the family, is the, that Nephilim or that reptilian energy here. Okay? But I think these are the women like Superwoman that they were in that coven or like on The Walking Dead when they were in that group. You know what I'm saying? That they, um, that they didn't want to let men in, but there was a way for these men to get in or they had ceremonies once in a while where a lot of what they would have with men and I would think women would get pregnant during then. Right? And then these, and then Again, with Native Americans too. Around seven years old, these men would come back and grab these children and take them off. It's what it is. <laughs> you talk. This, uh, what? That's what I'm saying. I'm, this. This is. We can't. You could do what you want, but I'm not going to deny what the fuck this is within me. <clears throat> so again, this is going to leave somebody torn apart. It might be this masculine here because he was manipulated. It might be this masculine because he might be in the dark like I was. But I doubt anybody in this narrative or this situation, if I'm awake to it, I doubt anybody that's close to me that's doing this funny shit on the side and acting real funny and shady. I can sense it because now this person is tensing up and tightening up to me because he went back and took a deal with the devil. But before, this person was all grabby, grabby, but I've been celibate. You know, I've been because I'm, I'm listening to orders from a higher power here. Okay. So I think since they couldn't get me, they were, what, what did I just put on Instagram? Shea underscore seeking. Persecute. No, it's a word that I just put up. And it meant like pressure, like seduction. But thou shall not tempt the fucking Lord, right? Hmm. So there's this energy of trying to stir up that sacral or root chakra energy again. Okay. So that. Some penetration or something like that hermit card that I told you uh, that we watched, we had on the video the other day about penetration. Okay. Because after that binding or genital mutilation thing that I feel like a sense of something happened. It's almost like somebody wants to test something. Almost like how they used to do the um, women um, back in. Um, back in the day with royals, um, they would test them to see what was going on down there which is very insulting mm. hmm. but again the will of fortune is here okay and then um we do have the uh the ten of but see there's something about this rainbow it's just the rainbow not the family so this makes me think that whatever this is it's going to end out with something with that rainbow or that I don't know, I'm hearing hope or hopey or rainbow children aspect or me 
giving birth to all these children, this dream that I told y'all about the other day that I had when I was a child, about having children from India, from all seven nations or whatever. I don't call them continents. I only see two continents. If a continent is something that's a body of um, land that's surrounded, I mean, land that's surrounded by water or whatever. There's really only two, okay? But again, seven nations, okay? G7, okay? So this means that these people, generation or genesis or <laughs> seven, okay? So they're coming for the seed of the high priestess and the seeds of the empress, more than likely. She's been sitting here like a cash cow and people been making money off of her. So they're going to have to pay for that. It just is what the fuck it is. <laughs> so that makes me think that this rainbow is going to come from that, all right? But the family is not going to be a thing. This is making me think they're trying to get somebody to replace. Okay, so if some of these children are coming from afar, they want to sacrifice because they're afraid of this energy. But this energy is going to reign fucking forever. So, again, with others, of course. Okay, <laughs> of course with others. Right? Not that much will probably change. But it's just they're going to have to come see me. That right hand of God energy. That they tried to cut off. And that makes me think about the Trump coat of arms, right? Nobody would believe that one little person, this girl, that talks like this. But you, you've seen different pieces of me throughout this journey, okay? It's all still the same me. Anybody can say that this is how I've, I've always been. I'm passionate. I might be a little bit more, you know, but also I'm in my, my sailor mode, right? I'm, I'm maybe more in my sailor mouth or whatever. You know, I'm, th that's just what I'm probably in right now. Um, but, again, we have this strength card where whatever this is, this makes me think about, like, different um, groups and seers and readers, the ones that are paid, bought and paid for, not the ones that are authentic and legit. All right? They're, they're being put in reverse here. Like I said with that other video, we're using what they have here, the ones that may be involved in acting as if they're not, may have a little bit more insight because of AI, then they will say, um, we're going to use their own shit to flip the script. So, we got the hermit card here, okay? Shining the light on it. We, we don't need this. It, it's good to be, it's good to see where their mind, I go here sometimes to see where their mind is at. But I don't want to get tripped up on the tarot route. Like they said in Moana. So, I see it for what it is now. It doesn't hold, most of the time it's confirmation, like, to see what they up to. Yeah, what, that's what you're saying? And, 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 and I should be able to know and just go with that. But it's, it's fun for me. <laughs> because I know that this is what, look at this over here. This is what these people want to do. You see this little man or whatever this is hanging from this thing? See, motherfuckers think they funny. They, they forgot what I do or what I did prior to just reading the text for you guys. For the pet. They forgot, right? So this E right here makes me think about the E that's on the belly of the star card. <clears throat> right? Also makes me think about Eve, right? But there's a part of Eve here, or maybe Lilith, right? This is maybe this person saying that this is, she's the one, possibly, right? That she, they, they killed off, it's making me think about that show that I just seen a clip of, Killing Eve, okay? So again... <laughs> If these people trying to kill, they, if they trying to call me Lilith, the first wife of Adam, to kill me off to put Eve in position, right? So then, now there's an energy coming in right now of all the ancestors behind me that's going to kill Eve and put who the fuck is supposed to be in there there. So this is what signs and symbols run the world. This is what I see. I bet you, I guarantee, mouths are open when they watch this video. They won't admit it. But I'm telling you, it, it is what it is. God is not a man that she or he shall lie. Same time I feel like this Ace of Wands energy is coming back in. In his militant form. I feel like I'm in my Navy form. Okay. Trooper, so boots on the ground. So I'm looking at him as more of the earthly present. And then me with the maritime energy behind me, whether they want to do it physically or not, the maritime in energy is supporting me right now. The, the ocean chose me. <laughs> the ocean chose me. So this makes me think somebody else 
maybe a royal bloodline right now that's prominent may not be with us properly anymore. And somebody's trying to pull a quick one here. But through that energy of those connections, <laughs> because they, they, they have these codes set up where a person can't say, I was just reading about this um, before, right? That you can't say certain things or whatever, or it can get you in trouble for mentioning certain things before certain things. So we're not going to mention that, but we're going to just say, <laughs> See, man think that they got it all figured out and it ends with them. They don't know. Like Enoch said, they won't be aware. They can't tap into that. And any of this other shit that's not authentic and original is going to fade away. This is the first time I've ever seen this person with this setup here. And I don't know what this is. Okay, the evil eye and something else here. I mean, I, I don't know. People be like, oh, somebody sending you the evil eye, but they got the evil eye in their video. I guess somebody's saying that it wards off, but is that the truth? You see what I'm saying? <laughs> so again, now, since I'm speaking more things about this and people are going into my account and trying to delete in, in, in my videos and stuff like that in the family, right? Oh, you're crazy. I'm going to get you to see somebody. I'm going to get you to see somebody. And... The same shit that they trying to catch me up in after they figure out what they done did and how it's good. Because they so sure of they self, narcissistic, very sure of they self that they won. I'm hearing break, break down, steady breaking me on down. <laughs> and this is a breakdown, all right? Watch the breakdown. <laughs> Had a man last year, right? But it's a short life. You see what I'm saying? That's the part of that those lyrics that I don't get. But I see, I feel like I see even further than some of these masculines. They only probably got a part of it. And this is the rest. Because there's also this a forever thing, right? Somebody hate that they treated like a whatever thing. But unless somebody came and messed with this person's mind in some kind of way, sorcery, um, or, you know, altering mind control energy, maybe that's why I still hold that place for this person. Because I know better. That story didn't end. It ain't over until the fat lady sings. <laughs> or the juicy one. So, so yeah, <coughs> this fits the narrative, excuse me, throat chakra, okay? This fits the narrative <coughs> of all new everything. And I think that, that, well, I guess, well, because I feel like I'm saying that because I feel like this is the sense of whatever was happening in the, another dimension is going to be coming down now into the 3D. And people feel like if, if it did happen that way, they thought that it was going to be broken and we was going to be struggling. And I, 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 what the answer said, you was never supposed to be none of this shit. And they was never supposed to be sitting there watching you. This why they going to pay for what the fuck they did. So, again, whatever else they had placed up for you or snares, Christ crucified as a stumbling block. Whatever stumbling blocks they have set up for you, they're going to fall right into them. The pit that they put our pits family into a long time ago, they're going to be placed into it. It just is what it is. This is also the initial of my sister here, though. See, because my daughter said she had a dream, right? That she had a stepmother. And this stepmother kept her in the basement in a room. And was really, really mean to her. See, because I feel like what the answers is telling me is protect the children. So that means that somebody is trying to plan something here where they want to separate a connection. This child... It's, it's fearful of this happening because they she, she knows nothing is wrong with me, but she sees what, what, what her family members are doing. Mainly her sister and her father, supposedly. And so she's um, had this dream that this person put her in there. And I said, the way these females hate me, you will never 
have anything that come out my womb or that's already out of it. The ancestors are going to take care of your ass for even thinking of it. See, that's where they went wrong. This is to dealing with my babies on a, on, a, on a generational, national, global level. This is that whole love and war energy. I've gone through this several times. See why I keep having it over? Because this is the energy of that God's wife energy. But I feel like something happened to somebody. One of these masculines that, that have been there since... The, one of these gods, these old gods. Because they was tired of seeing this happen. And they felt like you prevailed this time. You showed your ass this time. They, it's not going to be that situation where somebody is acting victorious and they were not. No, you're going to get the victory for the people. Because that's the other post that I put up earlier this morning. And it all resonates with everything that's being said here. It's almost like if it got to be my last dying breath to tell my children, which is the fucking people, that I loved you. And I love you. And, 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 and the hardships and things may make it seem like it's something else, but it's all fucking love. Tough love. It's all love. For the sake of the people. So it's giving me that. Why I keep hearing. Sacrifice, um, God so loved the world. He gave his only begotten. Because again. I, they're trying to put somebody else in the world card energy. And make me feel naked and afraid. Or out. Cast out. Or whatever. But it's damn. They're like. You didn't cast me. I walked the fuck up out of there. So I can see what else is going on here. Because I couldn't see nothing in there. I couldn't see. I couldn't go higher in there. So it's almost like that energy of your love keeps lifting me higher. Right? Because I think they put some of these people to sleep. It's, I'm getting a vision of like an underground bunker with some people in it or something. Matter of fact, if you go back to like two years ago, I did a video where we were going doing some scans, satellite scans or whatever. And there were some interesting things there. Very interesting. They fear. See, they know not what they do. And they fear what they do not know. But that's not that's that's not going to happen anymore. You're not going to be able to ruin other people's lives and shatter them and leave them and rip them off and cheat them anymore with that shit. No more. That's why I'm here. That's why they won't be gone. Or out of the way. That's a war against God. Now it made me think about something that they said Mike Pence was excluded from showing up somewhere. Uh, when Trump was in, I think. Oh, I, I think it's some, yeah, maybe somewhere, or maybe it was something recent. But that made me think about something. Like, Michael and his angels tried to go up against somebody, but they lost. But I wonder if they won this time. I don't know. Hmm. Who to thunk it? And I still don't know who to trust. <laughs> I just know I hold a, a special place in my heart for one of these masculines. If I find out that he is innocent or changed his ways or really is genuine about the way that about this connection then it's always going to be open to that person but i can't have hope for that that's it's it's, it's it, it was tearing me apart i could not have i cannot hold that you know what i'm saying i can't have it like it was before because something and it's not my fault it's because things changed and i don't like to i don't want to smother nobody or make it feel like i'm you know what i'm saying so that's how i am that's real love. You let it go and maybe it'll come back. Because I can't discern who's the who, what, and what. Because this is a very sensitive case here. There's a, a lot of look-alike energy here. Yeah, and they all happen to be fine as hell. So, anyways, we're going to let it go. <laughs> Take care.